it's a wonderful place yeah. to live in. Yeah. And you know, it, it, you, you just can't get bored in UAE. I'm from a small town in India called Lucknow, which is uh, about 500 kilometers from New Delhi, the capital. Mm -hmm. um, that's where I was born and brought up. Um, I did my graduation, university degree in science in zoology, botany and chemistry. And I used to be a medical representative back home in India for six years before I came to the Gulf. I started my career from Oman, Sultanate Oman in 1985. Nice. Nice. And I joined a company in 1985 in Sultanate of Oman and I worked there for five years then I was moved to Qatar and then from Qatar to Kuwait and then finally in 97 I landed in Dubai. Um, UAE is the best place to live as far as my uh, experience goes. I mean it's the most comfortable place. It offers the best of lifestyle in the Middle East and it offers the best of liberties. Yeah. All kinds of, I mean liberties, your, you can practice your religious beliefs any which way you want and there is it provides a level playing field to yes, everybody exactly. what makes UAE different from the others is the comfort and the freedom to do whatever you want yes, yes. within the rules of the law and, and the basics to have a business yes the Safety basics business, the, it's yeah. a level playing field for anyone Qariyat al-Kitab was started three years back um, as a small enterprise and uh, uh, we are a direct sales company. We provide home learning material for preschool children yeah. to prepare them from home for the school yes. to perform better. You know there are two types of yeah, children yeah, in the classroom. Yeah. There are prepared children and there are unprepared children. Yes, exactly. We bridge the gap between home and school. Yeah, it's a nice idea. The so products we have prepared the children to perform better in English, math, science and almost all the subjects. That's how they do. We represent uh, some of the world leaders in educational publishing. For example, we represent educational technologies. Yeah. Educational technologies is a division of Times Publishing, which yes. is famous for its flagship Time magazine. Uh, we represent them as an exclusive distributor for the entire GCC. And we also represent a publishing company from America called Infant Learning Company. Nice. And uh, a company from Germany, Hamburg, called Early Learning Group. So these are the products which are combinations of books and CDs and DVDs. They are full of fun. They are loaded with a lot of uh, activities and interactive stuff. So the kids will improve themselves? In they, yeah. See, small children cannot make the difference between fun and play and, and serious and studies. Yes. For them it's the same. Yeah, of course. So to so mix it together, it will be... You good have idea. to provide yeah. them products which entertain them and, and educate at the same, at the same time. time. Yes. From where you got this idea, Mr. Jana? I was, I, when I joined, when I a company in Muscat, I used to sell world book encyclopedias, you know, Mausuat al Mujallad Yes. So I, I used to sell world book encyclopedias door to door. And that's where I spent something like 13 years in that company, yeah. selling world book encyclopedias, child craft. They had a wide range of product. It so happened that uh, the company slowly started going down. And that's when we decided to get out and start our own company. Yeah. I started another company with a couple of partners uh, and we decided to bring in products which are more child friendly. Yes. In three years back I quit that company and uh, You started your own business? I started my own, company. this company, Qariyat Al Kitab. Yes. I have a couple of investors but uh, they are sleeping partners. I'm the one who's running the show here. But yeah. I'm not the one who's doing it alone. As you can see, there's a team outside. Of course, always should be a team. <laughs> yes. Behind the scene. <laughs> yes, I, I, I'm yeah. not alone who's guilty. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I have partners. Oh, I have partners in crime. They are yeah. sitting outside. The biggest partner in crime is a Filipino guy here called Richard. Richard Cholo. Nice, yeah. He is the one who has helped me build the team here yeah. and move the business forward. So I am not guilty alone. Yes, right now we are very understaffed. We have only one office in Dubai and we are not able to cater to the whole of UAE. Yes. Um, we have just seven, eight people here. UAE is too big. We want to double our field strength. Mm. 
in the next couple of uh, in the next year or so and then we want to move to Saudi Arabia to Kuwait Bahrain and other territories and also to African countries okay, we want nice. to go to Egypt Lebanon mm -hmm. these are the markets where we, we know that people are interested in our products they understand the need for support to children in the formative years which is the first you know the first five years are the most important years the yeah. first first five years are more important than the last five years okay. In the direct sales domain, we are the only ones. Nice. There are a lot of bookshops who have similar products or products of a little lower grade, and they're selling from the bookshops, but the products that we have require an explanation, a presentation to the family, and that requires a qualified and trained sales force. They go to families, they meet husband, wife together, they explain the products, they look at the child's age group, and then they figure out the child's Problems, problems or issues abilities. related to yeah. language literacy yeah. or mathematics or mm. you know those basic issues that the children go through um, before getting the product and then yeah. we show the products according to that yeah. uh, requirement uh, ba based on those those issues well for small children it's easy for people to leave everything to the school yeah the exactly. school will do it all but if the school could do everything then no child would have bad grades yes exactly no child would be sitting on the back bench. Yeah, exactly. I was a back bencher myself. I mean, so I know it. <laughs> that children who are sitting in the back benches are not stupid. Yes, of course. They don't have the required home support. Yes. So should, should always should be a home support. Home support without kids, yeah. without <laughs> parents involvement. See, home is the first school that a child attends. Exactly. <laughs> and mother is the first and most qualified teacher yeah. for any child. So our, our business revolves around children and uh, what made me stay in this business is this, that I love children. Yes, that's why you got this idea. Mr. I Chandra. love to spend time with them. I love to talk to them. I love to tease them. I love to joke and laugh with them. Yes. Where else will you find such a wonderful company? And you like also to uh, uh, give them good products so get well educated. To feel that I'm yeah. making a difference in the early stage of their life which is the most crucial stage is a great feeling this is uh, this is not a simple job this is a humble job it's actually. it's a very fulfilling yeah. experience yeah. you know very very uh, i would say happy experience for me yes. just the thought that i'm making the difference at a point of time when it matters most Well, UAE played the most important role in my life in the sense that I met my wife here mm -hmm. and got married here. Nice. So that is one thing. Second, the ecosystem that UAE provides, the infrastructure, the ease of doing business, fantastic. Very nice. Fantastic. Very nice. And about also the safety. Yeah, yeah, we yeah. We are living oh, here. Oh, yes. It's it, was a, it, very, it is it's the a, most important thing. It's, it's a wonderful place yeah. to live in. Yeah. And you know, it, it, you, you just can't get bored in UAE. Thank you for all the opportunities provided. Yeah, exactly. It would not have been possible in any other country. Yes, exactly. I mean, at least in this part of the world. Yeah, yeah. Fine, I'm from India, so I know that things there are a bit different so yes. I mean I'm used to UAE it has become my second home yeah and I can't think of any other message just other than saying thank you yes my wife yeah. she has always stood by me through thick and thin and it's not easy when you start a new business it's not easy of course. so she has yeah. always been uh, with me and she has stood by me through all the tough times um, I want to say thank you to her name is Sajida very nice. Also, thank you, Sajida, for uh, making such a man in UAE. <laughs> she, she is a, she's also a teacher. She's actually a kindergarten supervisor in a school Very nice. in Sharjah. So you have the same uh, same interests. Yes, same, yeah. same interest. We both, yeah. yes. We have only two children. We wish we had more. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but, you can make more. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, it's a bit too late now. But we, we, we love children, both of us. Yeah.